Mm-mm. Yo, what's good, y'all? It's Lil' Hands, the world's finest YouTube all the time, man. If you just watched my last video, man, we just reacted to, um, what's the, what's the name? I, I'm bad with the names of these Heart songs. Part six. Heart Part 6 um, by Drizzy, BBL Drizzy, you know what I'm saying? And basically, we going to talk about uh, the, the multiple dishes between Kendrick Lamar and Drake. I think it's been three songs dropped evenly. Push-ups? No. no Family no, no. Matters. Oh, Kendrick might have dropped one more. Kendrick dropped. Kendrick dropped. Uh, the first song was Euphoria. Euphoria. Then he dropped 616. Family, they I mean, dropped, uh, they dropped, meet the Grams. They dropped meet the Grams, and they just dropped this. Like and then that. Drake dropped three. And then Drake dropped push ups, push ups, family matters, family matters and, and this. this. So yeah, it's four. Drake, I mean, Kendrick dropped four songs in total. Okay, and Drake and dropped Drake, three. Drake dropped three. So how do you? Who do y'all think is winning right now? Y'all go first. I'll, I'll say. There's two categories I say there are, and and there's one different winner for each one. The first one is just like in terms of this is for like Kendrick's winning because first of all he has more songs. He's talked about more different things, but um, relevancy. I think relevancy is important. Mm-hmm. I think relevancy is important though. What do you mean? Like, like right now? Cause like you could say like, yeah, Kendrick's is more like lyrical, clever, haha. You know what I'm saying? But it's mm-hmm. like I don't. It's not all necessarily true. If what well, that's what at least exactly. we don't know. We we don't know because we don't know these people in real life. But we don't exactly. know if if Drake's actually not a pedophile or Drake actually didn't have a kid. Like, how can you say he's winning? If just because he said something that's clever, because I can just I can make a, a fake up lie about you and it sound cool, but that don't mean it's you true. You can also say the same. Drake doesn't know if Kendrick. Yeah, Kendrick facts. That's that's so why I think you have to kind consider of... either all of it's true or all of it's not. Uh-huh. So considering what they wrote, given what look, let's say Drake did plan it right, mm-hmm. all the inf- the false information. Kendrick is using that information and creating a diss track from that. Mm-hmm. What he created was really good. So I'm saying that, that was what's on. I, I like meet the grams, meet the grams, order anything. Okay, but I think in terms of diss tracks, he might be up just because he dropped more, and the ones he dropped were crazy. I think meet the grams was super disrespectful. The other category is more so just like in terms of who's who's controlling this whole beef right now is Drake. After that, that power play that he just exposed that he did, yeah, and Kendrick just wasted his time. <laughs> yeah. I think Drake is winning in that regard, but I don't know. I ain't gonna lie. I feel like I feel like free. How you feel, Chigget? I feel like, so, I'll say, me, I think I'm a neutral. I probably say I'm a neutral in this whole thing. I like Kendrick, I like Drake a lot, Paul. Um, but, their music, my bad. But, I think, I think, in terms of winning, I think right now, I think Kendrick has a slight edge. What? Listen, listen, listen. Yeah. Let me land it. Let me land it. Because, I think when you think about what the diss tracks are, they're all different styles of rap. Or, let me just say music in general, right? Drake's being somebody who is a little bit more versatile, I feel like. Than Kendrick musically because he'd be singing, does the melodies, does the accents, does like different things. Cody. Also, Drake's been known for having his one of Drake's. Uh, let me just say, not just in his belt, is for the back to back song, which was a really, really, really good. It was kind of like his hit him up in terms of Tupac's version, like in terms of like a, a this song that went viral. Kendrick is, I think, doing it really well by <clears throat> almost like being Drake at his own game. Like he's making songs that are like kind of like. Now, I wouldn't say they're outside of his bag, but he's showing us a different element to like a rap this that Drake could do that he did himself, which I think is respectable. Also, if you think about the bombshells of the of the um, of like the of the rap at the time, uh, this may not may not be true, but Drake didn't. I don't I don't feel like personally Drake said anything that I didn't already have an idea of, and I don't think Kendrick said anything that I didn't know about Drake. Only that the kid. Now, if the kid thing is true. And if that seems to be catching wildfire. I think that put, has a slight advantage because that's something that we didn't already know. We are, there were already um, there were already um, allegations that Kendrick was beating his wife. We already know allegedly that he cheated on his wife with, with a white woman. We already know a lot of these things that he's saying. Now the molestation thing, that's all interpretation. That's to me is new. But this kid thing is really really big because if he's hiding this kid again, because allegedly he was hiding a dodge from the world. If he's hiding this kid again, that's crazy. But let me ask you a question. Go ahead. What's if you're the biggest rapper in the world? What's wrong with hiding a kid? It's like, it's it almost is like it's like it's like it's like, it's like somebody, imagine somebody says you have a girlfriend, right? It's like why are you hiding your girlfriend? You're not posting them. <laughs> hey, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm but nah, I don't. But <laughs> it's like why? Just because I'm famous, like just because I'm famous mean I got time. If you're kid. proud, of, if like if you're proud of your son, and also mind you, the I mean, there's nothing wrong with porn star, but the the mother of Adonis is a porn star. Well, now it's not like it's not like. It's Michelle Obama or something. Mm-hmm. No disrespect, whatever. It's just these are just facts, by the way. So I think that like 
the fact that he tried to hide it, because maybe, I think Kendrick was trying to spit like you're, you were embarrassed of your son because you weren't like up front with saying, okay, this is my son. I just had a kid. I don't know, man. I just feel like, I, maybe it's just my, I see what you're saying, but maybe it's just my perspective. I'm like, bro, man, I don't see nothing wrong with, with hiding a kid because why people got to be in my business anyway? You know but, what I'm saying? But also, it's like, it's like, like I feel like, I don't think it's the kid because he I th- obviously you can see he loves his son like I think you can see that but it's like the way in which he like went about announcing it to the world like I think well they force push the T force his hand yeah put exactly he should it's like it's so like, what he should have did a press conference and say hello every I world mean, I have a son most of like I have a son like I'm, I'm proud to welcome my son into the world but that's like your private life though that's not like that's your not son? fair. At some point, at some point, we're gonna find out anyway, bro. But he not posting his mom every day. Bro, he posts his mom all the time. Well, I mean, that's yeah. a bad example. He's not that's posting. What I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. So it's like, so you have a son yeah. and you're not letting the world know. But you post your mom all the time. So, so, now, so, he, so now he flexes. So if you had, if you, if you had a son, and now because okay, and now it's like okay, now that everybody knows about your son, now you posting your son everywhere. But you wasn't posting your son when he was a little baby or when he was growing up. So that's if you had a son right now, you gonna post him on Instagram? Yes. So, as soon. That's my son. But so, so you would be proud of your son. Why wouldn't I be proud? Are you proud of me? Yes, you ain't supposed to be. Yeah, bro, yeah. first they don't even post himself. I that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. No, but I'm saying, 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 but my point is, my no, it's not. I'm saying, what? my point is that if you have, a, if I have a kid, right, that's right. that's a reflection of me. Right. Every child is a reflection of the parents. Right. So if you have a child by somebody who allegedly and no disrespect, if you're a porn star, I respect. But we respect you. But I'm saying, if you're not, if you're not proud of the mom, obviously you're not gonna be more inclined to. It looks like you're not inclined to post your son. But I'm saying, I feel it's like, like it's like that's why that's why girls be saying, "How can we don't post me? You're not proud of me?" Because it's a, like you would you want to show the world, you want to show everybody how proud you are of a fit you're wearing. You want to show everybody how proud of um, things you're doing, but you're not proud of like your son. That's the whole argument. I feel and like you can be proud of something and not post it though. That's you though, but I'm saying a lot of people in the world don't think like that. But how you know Drake don't don't think like me? How you know he don't? Because think he like didn't me? post him. That's my point. But exactly, that's so how you don't know that he's not on my side. Because I'm on the because side. You can be proud of your son, but not post him. Let me you ask you a question. Bro. Let me ask you a question, bro. If you have a fly fit on, right? Fly fit on, and then you, you probably no you you probably gonna post like yo I got fly fit on because you're proud of what you're wearing. You feel like it's an, a representation of you. You feel like it's something that you want the world to see of you, right? If you don't have a fly, if, even if you have a fly fit on, why, why, like, even if you don't have a fly fit on, would you post you don't have a fly fit on? What well, one that's a little bit different? A fit, a picture of a fit is a little bit different. But I'm a saying it's still, a, but I'm saying a rep, it's still a representation of you, though. It's what you're showing the world of you. But like, I'm the type of person. I may get an accomplishment. I'm not gonna just run an Instagram and post it. But I'm saying though, that's you though. I'm saying that like more often than not, to other people, it looks like if you have a son, or if I you have a child, I, mean, I post the child. But you're posting yourself, you're posting your mom, you're posting mm-hmm. the things you're doing. It's like why are you posting everything else but that mm-hmm. one thing? Because if you're not, because like me for example. Like, like, that's why that's why people that's why people don't look like that's why I don't when you guys say I don't post it's not like I'm posting myself or doing anything it's like I just don't post in general yeah. now if I'm going places and I'm doing things and you're seeing me do things and you're not seeing me doing certain things it's like you're hiding it because you're not you're, you're just you're, you're moving the goalposts you're like okay I post my life but I'm not gonna post my son yeah that's why it's embar- that's why it's like why are you like hiding your kid from the world yeah. that's the only thing and then it's like you're gonna do that again with a daughter yeah. mind you it doesn't even and, and then by a woman you're not even married to you're not even married to. I think it's, bro, to be honest, I think it's all preference, bro. Because I, I right. personally don't see nothing wrong with, like, if, you're right, if I'm, I'm saying f- super famous like Drake, I don't see nothing it, wrong. It's wrong me. because you're posting everything else. Everything else, but, bro. That's the like, point. Like, a lot. Like, bro, Drake posts every single day on Instagram. It's not like, we're not even saying it's wrong. We're saying there's a question that should be asked. And then, bro, it's like... Because and, why? And then, bro, it's like, okay, bro, so you didn't post your son before, but then now all of a sudden that your son, like, we found out you have a son, now you posting the son all the time? That don't make no sense if you because you if you wasn't proud you wouldn't post them at all. Well, I can't defend that part because like it's not it's not me, but I'm saying like That's the I way. say the overall part. I don't blame him for high. I'm just saying I if if he's thinking how I'm thinking, I don't blame him for hiding. Something. But bro, it's like bro, it's like this. It's like if you have if you're not posting if you're not posting your um your child at all. If you say you don't want to post your child because it's private to you, why are you posting them now? Why are you posting after we found out? No, nah, I agree with you. If he's posting them now, that's like... That, that he that, is. That's not yeah, I know. I'm, I agree, but I'm saying like... I'm saying beforehand when it came out, I can't blame him for... Like, and the child wasn't... You act like the child was like 10 years old. The child... he, I think he, the little dude was only one at that point. So that's still re- relatively early. Like in a child, bro. Bro, bro. You know what I'm saying? And I don't think... The reason why I don't think he has a daughter now is because like they said the daughter's 11, 9, or however, like between those ages. <laughs> I feel like if he got caught up the first time with a one year old and he couldn't even make it past one year, how, how could he have made it past 10, 10 11 years of having a daughter? You know my overall point is, bro, I think, me being a neutral, I think Kendrick has a slight advantage. 
because first of all, you can't make a diss song about somebody and it's the record streaming for a song, this song ever. That's pretty crazy. Bro. But they said that he was bottom, bottom um, views. By view, yeah, he did. Okay, well, still, I think that he still has. I think that I think that I think that my overall point is I think Kendrick is beating Drake at his own game by doing songs or doing styles of rap because there's different styles of rap. We all know this, right? I think that he's doing different things that Drake has done before, just a little bit better and a little bit more clever. And I think also there's a little bit more depth, just a little bit more depth to what Kendrick is saying in terms of like the cleverness and the way he's going about this rollout. And I think that it's a little bit more catchy also. Because you got to think, like, for a diss song, you want it to be catchy. You want it to be things that people remember. Like, all these memes, yeah. all these, like, like think about the They Not Like Us, like the OV whole thing that's, like, taking over everything. And obviously, Drake is doing his own thing. But, like, it's not like Family Matters is over here, like, shaking the room. We like the song because we're Drake Shaker. fans. Because they didn't have the time to shake up the room. And they didn't have the time to shake the room. And that's yeah. why he's winning because it's like, bro, it's like if you drop 50 points in a, in a, in a, in a final, you lost, but you dropped fifty. But you lost. It don't matter. We gonna look at you lost anyway. And then, cause, cause you're, cause Kendrick is controlling the narrative. Because mm, let's say, more. let's say I drop a diss track, not anymore, and then you no, not anymore. But I'm saying, mm. it, I'm saying that he, it's the gap is closing. But at the time, it's like I drop a diss track, you drop a diss track, and I dropped another one, and now you're waiting. And he probably has another one. Yes. You see what I'm saying? How did that mean he's winning? Just cause he's I say supposed he, to be back to back. No, but I'm saying he's he's, he's controlling the narrative because he's not allowing Drake's music to breathe. But. Dude, bro, I don't think dude, all, none of these songs is having a chance to breathe, bro. All of, they both no, are dropping back no, to back. No, 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 the only no, one that didn't breathe, that didn't breathe was, was, um, was Family Matters, bro. Yeah. It didn't breathe. The, he didn't let uh, Drake. I mean, what? What's uh, he? Uh, Kendrick dropped. Uh, what's what's today? Sunday. Not Kendrick like dropped. Um, not like that. Wait, that's six sixteen. That's what was the last? That's the last one. Six sixteen when he dropped in the morning, and then later on the same day, Drake dropped Family Matters. Yeah, and then the day after that, no, that day Kendrick dropped after Drake dropped again, yes. and then he dropped one more the next day, which was the OV the whole thing, right? Yesterday. And then Drake dropped today, and, and that's no, not giving it time it, to breathe. It is giving it time to breathe because of of how close all the songs have been together. That's what I'm saying. A whole day is enough time to breathe. Drake didn't even have an hour, but he I don't. Have, he didn't have thirty minutes. I don't. But how long? How long it take you to listen to the song? It's not even about that. It's no, about it's the like, whole impact on social media and everything, like yeah. for people to talk about it and be like, "Damn, this thing is ass." Yeah, because but I don't. know. I feel like that's like an irre- me just me. Probably I feel like that's a regular, irrelevant like thing to bring up. No, it's no argument. No, because bro, it's, it's like it's like if you're in a basketball game, bro, you pull up, you do a crazy move, and you pull up for three, you make it. You jog back there, you make it three. You like, damn, I did all that for nothing. Yeah. Think about say that again. Think about a boxing you, match. Bro. Okay, think about exactly. Think, think about, about a boxing match. match you hit me with a jab, I hit you with a hook. But who's to say that Kendrick's was a hook and that mine was a dad? Who's to uh, say? No, listen to the song. Listen to the song. Listen to Drake's song. No, they're both good. They're both good, but I think they're Kendrick's is a little bit better. Bro. You you think that you think that that's an opinion? I don't think that's all I don't, I don't even no, know. That, I, I don't even see it. No, but but you made it seem like Kendrick's is, is. But it, Kendrick's you know was saying? good enough to the point where it silenced Family Matters. For yeah, sure. bro. Look at I, look at the impact on social media. Like it's silence, yeah, bro. bro. I think, but it depends on what you look at. Okay, even if it wasn't good, the reason it got silenced is because even after Drake talked. Kendrick talked right after. Facts, bro. But, bro, you act like Drake has just been quiet for like two days, three days. I'm Drake is real, real, real quiet. like I'm hating on Drake, bro. No, I'm not saying, but you saying it like he talked about it, the Drake threw a jab and the kid threw a hook. He did. Bro, it's big. Bro, bro, why they both couldn't throw it's a, power, it's, a power, it's a power play by dropping your diss track 15 minutes after your opponent. And the, the, the diss track that he dropped 15 minutes after, he was speaking about Drake having um a, a daughter that we just all agreed we don't think it's his. So, how's that? It's not even about the daughter, bro. It's about, did you listen to the song, bro? I did. How he was talking to his son, how he was talking to his mom, how he was talking to his dad. He took the beef to another level, let's, bro. Let's look up the bro. I don't I think he really heard the song, bro. bro I, I think you heard it, but I didn't think you were listening. Yeah, bro. You know what's the difference? Okay, I, I'll just use this to, for, to say the argument I'm thinking of. So he says, I look at him and wish your grandpa would have wore a condom. I'm sorry that you got to grow up and then stand behind him. Life is hard. I know the challenge is always going to beat us home. Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we're grown. So is that not something you can say about anybody, any father, any like anybody with a son? You can't say, you act like this is just such like, this is like, a very wow. Small, you're, 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 okay, you're taking like, like you have when, when it go, when it comes to, yes, when it comes together, but it all, all this, makes sense. <clears throat> how does it make sense? What is he trying to say? Did, did you, okay. What is he trying to say? He's talking about his habits as a man. That make him an unsuitable <laughs> father to raise a child. Like what? 
Pedophilia. Pedophilia. But how do we know drug that's addiction, true? Alcohol addiction, sex addiction, sex How do we know what drugs are? I'm saying, how, how are you going to say what drugs we're, we're not. Is? We're not saying it's true or not. We're saying he said it. And as of this, if that is true, it's crazy. But that's why I'm saying. It's the same for both. You, you have to. You can't. That, that's, that's, all, that's all I'm trying to say. I'm saying, like, how can you say? Because you, he so said. At this he, point, none of this tracks matter for anybody. That, and that's why in the first week, I said, I think the, the it's kind of tough to say who wins. Notice, I didn't say who I thought had an advantage. I didn't yes, say. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I didn't say. I didn't say. I didn't say. I didn't. I said which song I liked more. I no, said which no, song I liked more. Drake Drake I, we go, if I eat the biscuit, if we, I watch back and edit this, and I said and I think Drake's winning. Drake hey, okay, if okay, if I said that fairs, but look, let me actually like objectively, Bro, honestly say this: I don't think anyone's winning because it's all opinion. Because I don't like Kendrick that much as it is, so obviously I'm gonna be biased. Y'all like Kendrick, but like Drake more. No, yeah, so, y'all are like more on the Drake side. I feel like I'm more of a neutral. Right, so regardless, like people are gonna have most likely have one more that they like than the other. So it's kind of tough to say because it's not no clear winner in in this battle. Like Meek Mill was a yeah. clear winner. We know Meek Mill wasn't coming back. Um, Pusha T was a clear winner winner because he ain't even respond. So we yeah. you know what I'm saying wow. stuff like that is clear winners, but something like this is like it, I don't think it's a clear winner because it's all opinionated. Unless it's like unless unless like like I said, unless it comes with receipts where we can prove that Drake, I mean uh, Kendrick hit his wife, yeah. or we can prove that Drake. Um, was hiding the daughter. We could prove that Drake is was a pedophile or whatever. I don't think that's like... Because at, at the end of the day, I don't believe everything I hear anyway. I thought that's why you brought up who do you think is winning because we know there's no winner. I thought that's why you brought it up. So, okay, let me ask a better question. Well, I think this question will better suit what you guys explained and what I explained. Who do you, whose this is do you like more? So, you guys mm. said... You guys think off of just straight music, not um, relevancy. With straight music, you guys like um, Kendrick's more. I like Drake's more. I like Family Matters the most. As a song, but I'm talking about like collective diss tracks, like not just oh, like like, yeah, like of what they've dropped towards each other. I don't like I don't like Kendrick's sound of the music of I don't like how the music sounds, but then then again I don't like Family Matters from Drake's. You I don't like, like push ups. You ain't like this one. And this one doesn't sound great at all. Mm -hmm. This one just he was just speaking facts or facts. <laughs> that's why I'm. That's why I'm saying, like trying to say. I think it's like two different categories that you have to judge when it comes to this. Is it's like you have to judge relevancy, and like of is what you, this person is saying like ooh a burn like is that gonna like burn burn you like, is that gonna make you you know what I'm saying is, or is he just talking because like, I can easily say I'm gonna pull up and kill you. That's not really me dissing you because like you know what I'm saying that's not necessarily like I, if I get, it makes sense in my head. Hopefully I probably explain that bad. But I'm saying it's either you could you could it's a category of relevancy which is important and it's a, re a category of how it sounds. I think relevancy is way higher in the district. Right? I do too, but we can't prove if any of this is relevant right now, which is why I'm saying I just kind of tough but, to but tell. What we can prove is when you heard it did it hit this sound did it, yes. it was a good good bar and if it is true, you have to judge based on if what they're saying is true cuz the diss track they wrote the diss given information that they have. So mm -hmm. if that information was to be true, that determines the quality of the track itself. Mm -hmm. But I, mean? I think, but I think that also like, I just think that you kind of describe like how it sounds, which I think is important. But like being that we're still mm -hmm. waiting for relevancy, that's why I'm saying it's kind of tough to pick a winner since it's so neck and neck, and it's so this person can say one thing and then this other person can say one so thing. So in order to judge, you have to just assume both are true. I mean, that's what I'm doing. But yeah. okay, if you assume. If you assume both are true, did you learn anything new from what Kendrick said about Drake? Did you learn anything new? I don't know. I don't know Drake like that. No, but I'm saying, I'm, but I'm saying, have, from what you've heard, did you learn anything new from what Kendrick said about Drake? Well, did you know? Did you know he had a daughter? Did you know? Allegedly he had a daughter? I, I don't know Drake though. So I, I mean, everything, I, everything is new. Right. I'm not trying to be different, but I'm saying, of course, it's new. I don't like. I don't know. But you know, he's a son, but you don't know him. I, yeah, but I'm, well, okay. that's because he posted this. Uh, I don't know if, what Drake has. Like, yeah. Yeah. I don't know what Drake cool, has. Bro. You know, bro, why are you? Why are you like I'm not trying to be difficult, bro. I swear. We know bro. we know Drake as a celebrity. We know certain things about. Yeah, we him. do. Well, we know certain. We know things he about used to be these are facts, bro. Well, not facts, but these are things that are common. At least have been dispersed as quote unquote common knowledge. You know, Drake has a kid. You know, Drake be like allegedly be with underage girls. Yeah. Allegedly, like so, even if it's true or not, you still have heard about it, right? So yeah. you ha have you ever heard about him allegedly having a girl before this district? Yes or no? No, I have not. That's the point. So you, have you ever heard of uh, Kendrick Lamar's wife getting hit by his Yes, dad? yes. By who? No, no, no. Uh, that's what I'm saying. I know. That's what I'm saying. That's, that's, what I'm saying. that's, that's also what I'm really saying. good. That's, that's also really, really good. Though, but I think, like, I think to me, I think it's a little bit more of a bombshell because it's like the same way that Pusha T dissed Drake about so I know he didn't respond. That same principle, Kendrick's bringing up again with another child. So let me ask you a question. Let me ask you, and I want you to be honest. Forget Kendrick and Drake, right? Let's say, let's say, what's more, what's more, what's worse of an exposing? 
Me exposing that. What's more? Well, no, let me ask you. Let me ask you. What's what's worse? Me exposing that you have an eleven year old daughter that you didn't tell the world about, or me exposing that your manager hit your wife? It's not even about. It's about having a daughter, being a sex offender, being a sex trafficker, being a pill addict, and all those things together. But what about what about being uh, one? Just claiming all this like black lives, not black lives, right? But claiming uh-huh. all of this like liberation for black right. people, but having a. Um, I don't know the white his wife's Fire. specific race, but a mixed wife. You know what I'm saying? Um, being being abusive to that mixed wife. Uh, you know what I'm saying? What else? Having your manager. You know what I'm saying? Claiming like not claiming kids, but you know what I'm saying. All of that I, is like it's just as bad. It's just bad. I hear it. It's, it's like it's not and like just Drake is just way worse than. And what he's saying is that when it comes to the things we're hearing about Drake now, we already know. But when it comes to the things about Kendrick, we didn't know. We didn't know, bro. I w- so that's why we're, we're if anything, on your side. Wait, you said you already, wait, how do you, how do you already know that? Niggas wait, know, wait, you said you already I, had know. Already, I had already heard about um, certain things about Kendrick, like cheating with the white wife. Like, I, yeah. I, I'm cheating with the white woman, allegedly. I had already heard that, bro. So Drake bringing it up to me is like, okay, like, you're saying something to the common person who doesn't know. It's like, oh my God, this happened. But, 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 to me, but, but to me, I'm talking about how I felt. Pause. When I heard when I heard the the diss track, I was shocked to hear that Drake might have a kid. I wasn't shocked to hear Kendrick um, Kendrick had a uh, Kendrick had cheated on his on his long term girlfriend, quote unquote wife, because because of the fact that I had already heard it before. But that's one thing you were you shocked to hear that his manager might be piping his wife. Was you, was yeah, you, I was shocked. So but I shocked wasn't as, I wasn't as shocked to hear Drake has another kid. But. But listen, that's why I think it has a little bit more. You also said you also said that you had heard before that uh, Kendrick has been cheating on his wife. You've also heard before that Drake has been talking to younger people. But I'm that's saying, what he's saying. That's, what, that's what I just said. But no, but dude, 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 you just made it seem you just made it seem like because you had already heard that Kendrick uh, Ali allegedly cheated on his wife, that that added more to his art. To, no, to no, that that added more to like the validity of Kendrick's argument. No, I didn't. So what, what were you trying to say? I was trying. What I'm trying. Bro, listen, the frame, so this is what I'm trying to say. Bro. I'm saying. There are things I've heard about Kendrick and there are things I've heard about Drake. Right. Now, the new things I'm hearing about uh, Drake, to me, are a bigger bombshell than the new things I'm hearing about Kendrick. So, the new things that is the bombshell is the kid about Drake, and, and the, for Kendrick, what's the bombshell? No, the kid, the, the bombshell about Kendrick was the fact that he was being on his quote unquote wife that he hasn't married. Right. Yes. And to me, I think the kid is a bigger bombshell because. He was this by Pusha T by hiding his kid from the world and he's doing it again. Like, he's just like proving, his, proving Pusha T's point. So you're not really like that's that's to me, and then also it's like I feel like for me for me like knowing Drake how I know Drake like him being like obviously like an artist I follow, not follow artist I listen to, I think that for him posting his life and then like n- hiding his kid from the world, I think to me is a little bit not it's not it's something I really can respect because he's posting his whole life and then he's not posting his kid and then after the kid came out. Now you're posting the kid, and then you do that again with the daughter. It's almost like you're not proud of your son. I can't respect that from a from a man perspective. I can't really respect that, bro. Because okay. that's a, that's your seed. That's just to me. How that's about, just to me. How about now? At this point of the rap beef, he's exposed that if this is also true that that he set that whole thing up and that's fake. Now that bombshell is erased. Yeah, that bombshell is erased. Wait, hold on. Before we get to the a fact that if it's erased or not. Bro, you just said, you just said out of both bombshells, Kendrick's bombshell of, of, of him beating his wife and Drake's bombshell of not admitting to the public that he had a kid. You said what was, a, I don't want to speak for you, but from what I just heard, you just said that the bombshell of Drake not having a kid and not claiming him publicly, claiming her publicly on the internet was worse than Kendrick Lamar beating his wife. Bro, but the thing is, we already knew. Kendrick. So let's say not worse, like that, more so let's right. say you were, let's say you were famous, right? And you, God forbid, you did both of those things. You were hiding the daughter and you beat your wife. Which would you rather have be leaked? If you had to have one of them leaked, which, which would you rather? I don't think have you're be saying leaked? worse. He no, was I'm more saying well, I was more shocked to hear because I already knew Kendrick and his wife had issues before. Hence, why he cheated on his wife. Are, uh, uh, well, and he, that's he also that's fair to say you were more shocked. He also made a whole album about his issues with his wife and how he went to. That's my point. That's not if you're gonna say that's more shocked, but I don't think that adds or subtracts from Drake's um. That's not what he's. I'm not saying that. He's just I'm saying not which subtract- one is it's not subtracting from Drake. It's to me, it's a little bit more shocking. Which, he, that's why he said bombshells. Which one made you go, oh. That's the like, whole that's point it. of a diss track, bro, is to reveal something to the world that you didn't know about your artist. And I feel like to me, for listening to these two artists, I think Kendrick revealed something a bit more shocking, just a bit more shocking about Drake than Jake did about Kendrick. Because mm-hmm. I had already known that Kendrick and his wife had issues long standing. So to me, it's like, obviously, it's a horrible thing that he, if he's beating on his wife, and yeah, I get it. But it's not like it's out of the realm of possibility because. 
they already have issues with their relationship anyway. They've been they've been together for since they're well not since they were kids. They've been together for a long time. He still hasn't married her, and then he cheated on her with a white woman. He claiming to be black Messiah. Like his whole narrative of who he is, like being compromised to me. I think that's a bit more like shocking. I I, I see what you're saying. I guess it's more shocking in, to the people who don't know these people public like in person. It's more shocking that having a kid than having a troubled relationship and hitting your wife. Like that's a little bit more like predictable, if you will. But less, I still. Less I said a bit more, a bit less shocking. Uh, but, but, I said a bit more shocking. I, I meant a bit less shocking. But I think I think I agree that it's it's like you know what I'm saying shocking. But I still, regardless like whether it's shocking or not, I feel like that exposal of Drake having a kid, if it was true, which we all don't think is true, because he said no, he, he can say anything, but they proved that it was like just bait. They I think that's. I think it's still more. Well, well that what? Well, yeah, they didn't prove. It could like, be a big cover. Up. Yeah, it could be. Because he, he, maybe he's thinking Kendrick can't prove that I have a kid. There's no evidence of it, so I'm gonna just pretend like this was bait. That's a possibility. I just want to put it out there. But yeah, it could could be. But I don't know. I think regardless, I think like the stuff. Like if we're just assuming everything is true. Yeah. I think the stuff that Drake. I mean, uh, um. I think the stuff that Kendra's getting accused for is slightly worse. I can't, I can't. If every, if we're just assuming everything is true, the pedof- the pedophilia stuff, that's tough. I think, I don't know if pedophilia is tough, worse than probably. It probably is worse yeah. than beating your yeah. be- domestic abuse. It, probably. This is just opinion, but yeah. I think yeah, it is pretty bad. But it's but, all, it's also not something that. It's also something that to me, it's not something I'm like. I haven't heard before. I wasn't. I wasn't surprised mm-hmm. to hear. It. Like you see what I'm saying. To hear that about Drake. That's why, to me, like, it was like, okay. Like, it's shocking. Don't get me wrong. It's a bad thing, like, a horrible thing. And if this is true, like, this is horrible. But to me, I wasn't really shocked because that's just kind of how Hollywood is. Like, it's just weird. Like, these people do, like, weird stuff. But that's just people in general. People, people in general. Yeah, but, I mean, they're, it, like, it's like, you're there's smoke, there's a fire, bro. I feel like. Yeah. And then, because I already smelled the smoke, I'm like, okay, the fire is here, allegedly. It's like, I'm not really shocked. Like, that's what that's how I think about it, bro. Personally. Also, like, even though it's, you know, it's up to, like, personal preference which one is, like, crazier from each side. But I, I like the way Drake goes at those things that he's exposing. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I, I like the, the way he writes his lines more. I'm not saying it's better, but I just personally prefer it. Yeah, because Kendrick d- d- is kind of deflecting. He's just, in the, new, in the new diss tracks, he was just going, like, doubling down on what he said about Drake, not responding to what Drake said about him. Yeah, 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 you're right. You're that's right, fair. That's, that's a, a good, good point. point. But I like how he said A minor. Like, that's, like, clever stuff. Like, it's kind funny. Of, that's what I'm saying. It's kind of clever, bro. Yeah. OV Ho. That's not really that clever, but he made it to, like, something where, like, it could be consumed by the masses. Yeah. Because it's kind of catchy. But when Drake, like, when Drake said the thing about, uh, like should hit me back when it won't. Yeah, it won't that, was like, that, like, that, that was crazy. Like that was crazy. Like that type. He's bro, doing that. Yeah, like he's that, like that. But that's crazy. so like on both sides, bro. That's so impressive to me. Like you can hear this track and in a few hours, like cook one up and like it be clever like that, bro. Because if I wanted to, I couldn't think of like a line about something that simple that clever. I couldn't make it that clever. Mm-hmm. That's, that's, that's super impressive, bro. That they could do it that quick. And I that's one thing I respect, bro. That they're doing it back to back like that. I respect yeah. that. I respect that. Mm-hmm. Man, good time for I think good time for music, man. I don't know. Regardless, I honestly I I predict it's not having really a loser. I feel like it's all going to just be on, on your personal preference. Hundred percent. I think I think it is all all interpretation at the end of the day. But I think that for me, uh, I'm just happy we get more music. To be honest. I think though, if you like, but I you don't really like Kendrick though. So it's like I, yeah, I mean, so it's like you're not really moved. For you, you're like you like Drake. So it's like okay, you don't get hear new Drake stuff. Me, I'm a neutral. I like both of them. So I'm hearing Kendrick for after like a long time, and I wasn't really a big fan of Mr. Brown. So now I'm hearing new music that I actually read, like like like, not like us. That's, I like that song first. Yeah. I think the um I I, I, I didn't <clears throat> I think um if you want to talk about like commercial success, I see Euphoria and the one the Ov. What's the, I didn't get to listen to, but I saw I heard that song. Like people was messing with it. Like I think commercially that'll do better. Like because you could play that in more settings than like the songs that Drake dropped. But I don't know. But I think regardless, I like I. Uh, this is his opinion. I find Kendrick Lamar's music a little boring. I think he's very, very talented. Like, like, Tim, like I compare him to Tim Duncan. I think Tim Duncan is, is one of the goats at his position, the, at the power forward position. But it's just boring to watch him play. Yeah. And that's just my opinion. That's just my opinion. I'm not saying like he's trash or nothing, but that's why I think I'm also like my bias is a little bit towards Drake. Cause like when I 
when I but we all have bias. Even if you're saying you're neutral, you're not 100 percent neutral. You're, I think uh, you know what I'm saying. I, but I think we all have bias. But it's dang. Where was I? I was going to go somewhere crazy with that with that point. We all have bias, but. So I, I forgot where I was gonna go with that, but man, I was gonna go somewhere crazy. But I think, something. bro. I think if you think about it, bro, like a lot of Kendrick fan base is white, right? A lot of the things he's talking about, we could like not relate to, but I think feel like we could somewhat like. It, it's not like for if you're if you're somebody who's hearing something like different about a culture, I think it intrigues you a little bit more. Whereas Drake talks about like emotion relationships, that kind of. It's, okay, this is what I was gonna say. The things that Kendrick talks about is a bit more niche. Versus like the things Drake talks about in his music. Drake talks about like relationships. Everybody has relationship issues. And well, most men like uh, talk about like opening up or like women empowerment. Drake has like a broader, he talks about a broader spectrum of things that relates to more people that like people mm-hmm. can resonate with, I feel like. Versus mm-hmm. Kendrick who talks about the black struggle. If you're not really black, you're not gonna be up in arms raising your fist, okay? But like if you're somebody who's like black and you resonate, or you're from LA, for example, that's why a lot of LA people are supporting Kendrick because he talks about things that actually happen in LA. You know what I'm saying? Or like black struggle or like um, wanting to do better for your people. Like a lot of people who are like like that, they can resonate with that. And it's a bit more like honed in on like that type of like those type of individuals. So if you if you don't really like that type of music, I can see why, you know. Mm-hmm. I get what you mean. You know what I mean? I get what you mean. When you were speaking, you know what I just thought about, bro? A classic. I bet y'all forgot about this. Reporter Justice. Ah, oh, you're weird. You're weird. You're weird, <laughs> bro. That was such a Everybody great song. Like, about why it, we man. got? Why they gotta be beefing, bro? Yeah. That was like. Uh, what uh, uh, really like your favorite. Uh, yeah, we gotta say it. Yeah. Yeah. Who got the better verse, bro? Yeah, we was just talking about this yesterday, right? It was yesterday. Ah, yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. they both did good. I haven't heard that song in a minute though. And when you think of that song, whose verse? Yeah, yeah. Who'd you just I say? I like Kendrick. Just, Kendrick was yeah. gonna, yeah. but Kendrick had more verses on there though. I think because it was his song. And then Drake, Drake had a good verse though. When I see that thing move, I just really yeah, fight. Yeah, that's a weird song, song bro. Yeah, I just say, nah, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Flip a coin, flip a yeah. coin. <laughs> if you take the best verse from Kendrick in that song, which if it was the second or the first, take the best yeah, verse the and then put that against, um, yeah, fair. I think the verse was better than the chorus. And I, no, just, 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 no, Put it in the sun. All right. Come on, bro. Man. Come on. Nah, that's, man. Nah. I wish they could make yeah, up, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope I hope they make up <laughs> after this, bro. You know what I'm saying? We're going to end this video because this video is like 30 minutes long. I'm probably going to chop up a lot of this. What do y'all think it'll win at the end of the day? I don't think it's going to be a loser, bro. I think it's just going to be like... Oh, this is still busy at the end of the day, bro. I just think Kendrick fans are going to... Bro, you know what you're going to If they drop a collab? Yeah, if they drop a collab. If they drop a collab, be like, oh, man, we got y'all. Or like yeah, something like that. That would be crazy. That would be wasting my time, bro. <laughs> Man, we talked about hate both of them, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Chess. <laughs> like, J. Cole got up out of there uh, real quick. He made a good business decision. Cole sucks, bro. Yeah, he wouldn't want no smoke in there, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Different animal. Different animal. But, yeah. man. Like but, cat. Nah, you hate. I am. Yeah. J. Cole not a cat. You hate. Yeah. I, you know, I'm, I'm not even like, like a house cat. Nah, I'm trying. They not like us. They not like us. Ain't nothing like us. That was kind of hard. If, like, I say J. Cole a dog. J. Cole. J. Cole a dog. And then. J. Cole a dog. And then. Yeah, how do you look around? J. Cole a dog. And then. Drake and Kendrick are probably lions. They're probably lions. Yeah. After the first time I did it on Oh, But nah, J. Cole is probably a dog. And then, like, a good pit bull. And then. Really? Drake and Kendrick are probably lions. Yeah, like, 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 <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, nah, it's like. Jay Cole. Jay Cole. I thought he was like. I was about to say, Daniel Cole. I thought he was. I was like, how are you going to follow up? Because I thought you were just going off different types of dogs. Nah. Yeah, because yeah, I was going to say, you might as well call him like a fool of name. Nah, that's home. That's if they're all the hoes, like. I said they're, rock, they're the Rottweilers. That makes it like he like he puts. And then. No. Okay, they're the Rottweilers and he's like a, like a French bulldog. Nah. Nah. French Bull ain't doing pitbull, that. Pitbull, 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 pitbull. 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 Pitbulls and... Rock, but Rockweiler, bro? Like I mean, German Shepherd? Like, yeah, Kendrick, German Shepherd. Yeah, Kendrick, so, German Shepherd. Yeah, free. free. But, man, little hands, man. What's flies, man? Family matters, man. <clears throat> hey, man. Tell Metro, shut us up. <laughs> 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 <laughs>